In this clip, I'm just going to show you how to format an Amiga disk. So, what I've done is I've loaded up Workbench on the computer, and um, I've got a, an empty floppy disk here. And what I do is I'm just going to put it in, and it says DF0, and then it's got four question marks after it. Let it chug in, there we go. So, I'm going to left click on it, and then I'm going to go up to the top and go format disk from there, okay? And then it'll just ask for Workbench just to get the information to know how to format it. That goes in. And I'm going to rename it so I'm going to call it. Some reason did that didn't normally do that. I'll try again, format disk. It's a bit odd, so perhaps there was just a bit of a gap when the disk came out. Let's put that in, replace workbench two, gets all the information off the the workbench. So we just name the disks. So um, I tend to name them after cars. I was thinking about getting this model. Um, so I'm going to just format it. Yep, and do format. So it's 880k disk. So these two are done earlier, that's fine. Um, it's 880k, um, just formats them. With the PC it's 700 and something, um, but with the Amiga it's 880k, and it just formats it to Amiga format. It's a couple of minutes or so to get that done. And there we go, it puts the name of the disk under there so um, I can identify the disk. And what I do is I click on it, right left click on it, and right click on the information, and it tells me the date it was formatted, so it's today. That, that clock is an hour plus. Um, that's how many blocks, that's how many used, and that's free. So, um, yeah, that's um, 880k on that disk. 